Welcome back everybody. This is Mr. Fada and in today's Fada Cat, I'm going to show you how I could draw a triumph arc by applying the rules of perspective to draw a three-dimensional rectangle and penetrating it with an arched open center. Triumphal arcs or victory arcs are monumental structures that were designed by the ancient Romans to often celebrate military victories. They were designed with two monumental towers connected by an arc and often have a flat top that features decorative carvings, statues, and various inscriptions. This is the Ark of Titus in Rome, built in 81 AD. The most famous arc is probably the Arc de Triomphe in Paris, France. It was built in 1806 to honor those who fought in the Revolutionary and Neapoli Neapolionic, Wars. Neapolionic Wars. This is the Narva Triumphal Arc, built in 1814 near St. Petersburg, Russia, in Estonia. It was erected to celebrate victory over Napoleon. We have several triumphal arcs here in New York. This is Washington Square Park in Lower Manhattan. It was built to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the inauguration of President George Washington. Here's one in Brooklyn, New York, what is known as Grand Army Plaza. It was built in 1892 and is dedicated to the defenders of the Union of the American Civil War between 1861 and 1865. First, I'm going to sketch out the 3D shape of a rectangular block with a large archway on the wide side and a smaller archway on the narrow side. I've also divided the rectangular form into three sections with small, medium, and large portions with the largest section at the bottom. I'm then going to refine my perspective drawing by darkening some lines. For each division, I'm going to extend the lines past the building to represent the molding of the building, or the decorative corning. I'll then work in some of the details and the medium-sized shapes. Now I'll shade the shapes to show the shadows and emphasize the three-dimensional form. Establish where the darkest darks are, and where the medium shades are, and where the highlights of the structure are seen. And finally, I'll try to darken some of my lines and rough in a texture effect to represent the decorative frieze and some of the structural elements. There you have it, everyone. I can draw a triumphal arc by applying the rule of perspective to draw a three-dimensional rectangle and penetrating it with an arched open center. That's, That's our Fatacast for today. today. Join, Join us, us next, next time. time.